Hello and welcome back to my Astro Imaging Journey channel. And today we're going to process the uh, NGC 6543, the Cat's Eye Nebula. So let's go ahead and open up our file here and let's get to work. Alright, image is open, so let's go ahead and just do a quick stretch and crop. And take away those dark bands on the sides due to the dithering. So let's just crop that in just a little bit. Alright, that's done. Alright, so next up, let's do a little dynamic background extraction. Well, let me go ahead and take care of this and we'll be back. Alright, as you saw there, I ran DBE twice actually. Uh, still getting some banding across the middle third. Looks like two bands underneath the nebula and above it. And a hefty amount towards the right hand side, so I'm not liking that, but we'll, we'll see if we can work with it. So let's do a little background neutralization, followed by a little photometric color calibration. Alright, and the problem I had with the PCC there was my initial search. I was searching it for M94, which is clearly not NGC 6543. So, but we got the right one. That's complete now. So, what do we got up next? SCNR to remove the green cast. Now a little RGB working space, even out the channels. Let's 
let's go ahead and make our synthetic luminance. And we'll go ahead and stretch that using the histogram transformation function. All right, so now we've got our luminance mask made. We can do a little denoising. Let's go ahead and get that mask on the image. Invert it. And apply the denoising algorithm. I should say multi scale linear transformation process. All right, the denoising is done. Normally now I would do deconvolution, but I've been having some issues getting that working at all lately. Uh, could just be the quality of the data. So I'm gonna go ahead and skip that. And we just added some sharpening. All right, so let's go ahead and convert this over to nonlinear. So we're going to bring up the multi-scale linear transformation, or excuse me, histogram transformation. Now let's go ahead and get this thing stretched out. Okay, so what you saw there was uh, I was trying to bring out that nebulosity, but I kept getting some horizontal banding, and there's a little bit there, and I just don't know if I like that. So let me go ahead and do some RGB combination. Let's see if. Uh, See if I can improve this a little bit. A little range selection. Create me a mask. I got my mask made, so let's go ahead and do a little HDR. And let's apply our luminance mask. Make sure we are. Okay, invert it, so... Yeah, I didn't want to invert that, so let's apply look, HDR to this and see what we get. Alright, that's complete. Didn't really notice a difference. Let's undo... Redo and maybe a little bit, not a lot. So let's go ahead and remove the mask, undo it. Let's create a new luminance mask. Or... Oh, I made a mistake. I fixed 
directed the channels as opposed to creating a luminance mask. So now we have a new luminance mask. So let's reapply this. So let's go ahead and remove the mask, close out HDR, let's do a little local histogram equalization. a little bit see if we can bump this thing up just a hair yeah I'm just not liking the banding I've got on that but let's just go ahead and finish the process. I'm gonna have to jump this one. So let's just see what we end up with. So let's do a little dark structure enhance just to see what we get. And it's done. Yeah, I'm not a fan of this. Uh, so I'm just gonna go ahead and say this was just not very good. So, uh, yep. We will revisit the image integration on this one. Uh, see if I can improve that initial data set a little bit better. So, with that, uh, thanks for watching. See you in the next episode. Thanks for watching yet another episode from the Astro Ninja Journey channel. Really appreciate your viewership. In our upper right, we have the latest video that I have posted prior to this one. Down in the lower right, we have what YouTube thinks you will enjoy. Below is a subscription link. Please hit that like button, subscribe if you so choose, ring that bell if you want to get notified of something new, and as always, thank you, Clear Skies. Remember to.